Hello everyone. Uh, from today, uh, I'm going to start uh, this discussion of case study based questions. So this is the first question I'm going to discuss. And uh, this is the question. The class 10th student of uh, secondary school in Krishi Nagar have been allotted a rectangular plot of land for their gardening activity. Sapling of Gulmohar are planted on the boundary or at a distance of one meter uh, from each other. There is a triangular grassy lawn in the plot as shown in this uh, below figure. This is the figure. And uh, the students are to sow seeds of flowering plants on the remaining area of the plots. So uh, the first question is taking A as a origin. Taking A as a origin, we have to find the coordinates of the vertices of the triangle PQR. So see the triangle, uh, the point P first. So uh, the x coordinate of point P is four, and the y coordinate of point P is six. So the coordinate of P is four six. So four six yaha pe jo teen uh, options mein hai. So now the next point is Q. The point Q, the x coordinate of point Q is three and the y coordinate of point Q is 2. So the coordinate of Q is uh, 3, 2. And uh, the 3, 2 is in two options, this one and this one. And the last one, the point R. The uh, point R, the coordinates of point R is uh, the x coordinate is 6 and the y coordinate is 5. So 6, 5 and 6, 5 is this one. So Finally, we conclude that the correct option is the first bit that is P46, Q32 and R65. Now the next question is what is the midpoint of the side PQ uh, when A is the origin. So A when A is the origin the coordinates of P and Q are 4, 6 and 3, 2 that we already got in the first question. And now the midpoint of PQ, PQ ka midpoint ka jo formula hai X the x coordinate is given by x1 plus x2 by 2 and y1 plus y2 by 2. So 4 plus 3 by 2 that is 7 by 2 and 6 plus 2 by 2 that is 8 by 2. So the final answer is 7 by 2 and 8 by 2 is 4. So uh, we have the correct answer second one 7 by 2 4. So now we are moving towards the next question. The next question, what will be the coordinates of the vertices of a triangle PQR if C is the origin? So now I'm going to rotate the figure. So this is the rotation of that figure. And this is the C, uh, C. we are going to take C as origin. So this is zero. Okay, now the point P, the point P is uh, here and the coordinates of point P, first of all, we'll draw the lines. So this is uh, 11 and this is 12 so x coordinate is 12 and the y coordinate is 2 so we have two options here 12 2 12 2 two options are there second and fourth one now uh, we are going to check for the q q is here in the 13th uh, column so this is the q and uh, the x coordinate of q is 13 and y coordinate of q is 6 so 13, 6. So I got the answer from here only the fourth bit. Now let us check for R also. The R coordinate 10, the X coordinate 10 and Y coordinate 3. So 10, 3. 10, 3. So the correct option, finally we got the correct option is fourth bit. Now let us move toward the fourth uh, bit, uh, fourth question. What is the midpoint of QR when C is the origin? So Q R already we got the coordinates that is 13, 6 and 10, 3 and we know the midpoint formula is x1 plus x2 by 2 and y1 plus y2 by 2. So 13 plus 10 by 2 and 6 plus 3 by 2. So we got 13 plus 10 that is 23 by 2, 6 plus 3 that is 9 by 2. So 23 by 2 and 9 by 2 is the correct answer. So here the third option is correct. Now, the given problem is based on which mathematical concept? 
so uh, this is actually textbook question and uh, uh, textbook uh, the context is taken by uh, taken from the textbook and uh, the chapter is uh, coordinate geometry so this problem is based on uh, coordinate geometry okay so this is the last bit of this case study uh, based question number 1 okay case study based questions is nothing but it is connected with some real life situation and uh, uh, real life situation based questions only will come under case study based questions okay so that's all for to, uh, this uh, session this uh, question thank you thank you uh, very much